everyone! Today I thought I would show you how to create this festive makeup look that suits deep set eyes, as I know it can be difficult to replicate other certain looks out on YouTube. So for starters, I've already applied my Rimmel Wake Me Up foundation and used my Essence Brow Duo to fill in my brows. Now I'm just going in with my NYX eyeshadow base in the colour white and smoothing that all over my lips to prime them for the eyeshadow that we we're going to be putting on. Please try to ignore the little line under my left eye that I forgot to smudge in. Promise I smudge it in later. Today I'm going to be using my Chi Chi Spices palette for the majority of the look. As my eyes are deep set, I'm not going to be working in any colour into the crease, but rather above the crease, so it looks a little more flattering. So I'm just taking this light brown shade, and as I said before, popping it just above the crease, because generally when you have um, deep set eyes, the colour can be lost if you just shove it right in the crease like other YouTubers do. So I'm just blending that out and using a fluffy brush to make sure the edges are all smooth. I'm just building up that colour using a darker brown from the same palette and basically I took about 10 minutes just to slowly build up this colour and make sure it's a really nice consistency. For the eyelid I'm taking this light shimmery gold colour and just patting that all over the lid. I then decided I wanted to darken the look up a little bit more, so I took this brown shimmery colour, placed it on the outer portion of where we contoured before and the outer part of the lid. Then I took this shimmer pigment by Essence and my Urban Decay setting spray and just sprayed a little bit on a flat brush and dipped my brush into the pigment before putting this all over my lid just to add a little bit more shimmer and shine as this is a festive makeup look that we're going for. Then I just used my finger and placed a little bit of the shimmer pigment in my inner corner to brighten up the eyes a little bit. Then took my Maybelline Must Precise Eyeliner and lined the top of my eyes. I decided I didn't really want too much of a graphic wing liner for this look, so I just created a subtle small wing that looked quite natural and flowed with the lash line, but obviously it's up to you. You can obviously choose how dramatic you want your eyes to look. So I'm just taking my time here and slowly building up the liner, making sure it's perfectly smooth on top and the wing is nice and crisp. I'm then using my Rimmel Wonderful Lies Mascara and applying a solid coat over my lashes to make them really fluttery and pretty. You can apply lashes if you want to, but I'm not very good at it, so I just prefer to go without. I'm then taking my Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Concealer, which is my favourite concealer, and just concealing underneath my eyes and down my nose and on my chin, sort of acting as a highlight as well as a concealer. And then I will just blend this in using my Real Techniques sponge. Using my Rimmel Stay Matte um, Powder, I'm going to set everywhere that we just concealed and highlighted to make sure that it doesn't budge throughout the day. Then 
going back to the first shade that we used in our eyes, I'm applying a little bit of that under the lower lash line just to darken up the area and make the eyes pop a little bit more. Then of course I'm going ahead and applying mascara to my bottom lashes. Next I'm taking my nearly used up NARS Laguna Bronzer and just adding a little bit of warmth to my face. Even though I've already got fake tan on this video, I feel that bronzer really makes your face have a little bit more dimension and shape and also makes you look very healthy and glowy. blush I'm just using my Essence Matte Touch blush in the color Peach Me Up number 10 and just applying this to the apples of my cheeks and blending it upwards. Finally I'm going to highlight with my MAC Soft and Gentle uh, Mineralized Skin Finish just using a fan brush and applying that to the top of my cheekbones and a little bit on my cupid's bow. For lips, I'm using my Essence Lip Liner in 08 Red Blush and just lining the entire of my lips and filling them in to make sure that my lipstick stays on for the majority of the day. As you know, over Christmas time, you will be eating a lot of food. <laughs> And over the top I'm applying my Rimmel Kate Moss lipstick in the shade 31 which is a really beautiful um, deep purpley red colour. I think this really suits this look as it is very festive and kind of reminds me of like cranberry colour. And here is the finished look. Even though it's pretty simple, I think it's very elegant at the same time. If you enjoyed this makeup look, please give the video a thumbs up, it really helps out a lot. And I hope you all have a very Merry Christmas and a safe and happy new year.